on. <laughs> okay, clap three times. It's a bit pathetic. That's okay. Shut up. That's a nice start to the morning, isn't it? Yeah. Just a minute then. <clears throat> Good. Good morning and welcome to Mel and Lisa at 7.16 on a nice, cool, frosty, crisp, autumnal, autumnal, did you know that? Well, autumnal. <laughs> no, not autumnal, autumnal. Autumnal. No. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> You're off already. Don't laugh too loud. Shut up. Say it again. Autumnal. No. Autumnal. No. <laughs> Autumnal. Autumnal. Right. Can you spell it? No. <sighs> Don't want to spell it. <laughs> You're have to put the blowjobs on. Yeah, it's freezing now. No, no, I mean, because everything's a bit misted. Okay, right, so. We haven't uh, done a Saturday morning video for. Pages. 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 Ages. Pages. 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 Ages. 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 Yeah, all the Fords are uh, heated, so it defrosts really, really quick. I haven't put the front-facing camera on today, because uh, time-wise. Right, anyway, where were we? Oh, yeah, autumnal. 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 Welcome to Mel and Lisa. We had a nice autumnal morning. Yeah, we haven't done uh, one of these on a morning. Uh, if you remember one of the later uh, little videos, tea lady was actually leaving her lap dancing club and she's now started a different lap dancing club one for the hard of hearing and the short sighted and whilst I'm dropping her off in a similar place uh, she actually catches a buzz <laughs> look at the way that's glowing because of the way the sun's coming up you see yeah. Yeah, they can't see because we haven't got a camera here we go pixel tree is it a little bit blinded? So now, right, as a general rule, during the week she does, she starts at nine o'clock and finishes at eight o'clock. I know. And she does that for... <laughs> <coughs> 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 You're not supposed to... <coughs> no. Excuse me. She does. Oh, oh, look at that. Oh, she does. Oh, man. She does that. <coughs> Good morning and welcome to Mel and Lisa on this autumnal morning. Got a car up my ass. Just because he wants to go 50 more than Aaron. <coughs> 50 miles. This is going to need a lot of editing, isn't it? Oh, uh, do you know what? I don't think I'll bother with this unit. I'll just leave it as it is. Why is my car going so fast? I don't know. Oh, that's why. Anyway, um, where was I? Oh, yeah, so she's, now she's catching the bus. She's doing uh, nine in the morning till eight. Which doesn't sound too bad, you know, she does it three days a week, which sounds even better. Um, when you work in retail, doing three or four hour shifts every single day just knackers up your day. So sometimes, you know, doing uh, doing all your hours in sort of three days which is good. gives you the rest of the time, which is quite good. The only downside, of course, is it takes, what, about an hour and 20 minutes to get there? Uh, just over an hour. So just over an hour to get there by bus, right? Yeah, but it's so but, straightforward. But, yeah, but when you come back, right, the buzzes change. So she finishes at eight, but her buzz doesn't come till one minute past nine. So as a consequence of that, she goes, oh, that looks good. And we haven't got the camera on, that looks really good, doesn't it? Um, as a consequence of that, she doesn't get home till 
what, quarter past half past ten uh, most of the time, when yeah. she's working. Now, yeah. in itself, you think, oh, it's not too bad, but she'll be up at five the next day if she's working the next day and out again. But the worst bit is, right, I come home at seven o'clock normally. And now, the days that she's working, I walk in and the lights aren't on, the telly's not on, the Simpsons aren't on, there's no bag of snacks sitting on the settee waiting for me, there's no food cooking in the oven, in fact there won't be any food at all, there isn't even a cup of tea on the table. So. So whilst it doesn't sound that bad, it does have its knock-on consequences, which is not good. It's yeah, not good but that's all. three days, seriously. Three days. Four days, you get my full attention. You get your cup of tea, you get your Simpsons, you get your snacks, you get your food ready for when you come in. Four days out of seven. You get a nice cup of tea. Most you get some time. loving and cuddles. Give so four, four days. I get some loving and cuddles and on the days you, you work wait till Christmas. It might not be four days, it might only be two days. What, you're only going to work two days at Christmas? No. I'm saying that it'll I don't be... mind if you want to work 70 hours, that's fine. Let me work that out. <sighs> 70 times two. That's 140 quid. Brilliant. Isn't it a bit sort of achy though, doing pole dancing for that long? Very yeah. Anyway, you never thought I, I need get to get achy. this in, I need to get this in. It's something I've just remembered. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Some t- oh, bollocks, my camera is <laughs> <laughs> Oh, for God's sake. Epic fail. Let me... Let me pull over. Oh, no. I'm pull into the cycle lane no. and annoy the cyclists. No. <laughs> that was embarrassing, to say the least. Stop your love. Second time you've been embarrassed this year. <laughs> well, I haven't gone really embarrassed, but. No, but still. Look, look, you'll have to make do with that angle. Sorry. Go on. Just a minute, just a minute. Make sure my touches are in the right place. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying before, I so rudely interrupted. Now I've got a bouncing bloody camera. <laughs> Swept. We're going to end up looking at your camera more than my camera. Come on, it's... say what you've got to say. going up and down like I don't know oh, what. Oh, shut up. Hang on. Oh, there we go. That'll be better. So, anyway, um, one of the previous videos we did called Lambgate was explaining how Lisa likes her meat. Right? Oh, no. Or should I say... <laughs> or sh... Stop laughing at me. Or should I say how she likes to cook it and... When I say cook it, I mean, well, some of them she can cook, some of them she doesn't. And as we discussed in Lambgate, she has this serious issue with lab. Anyway, actually, that wanted me to go a different way. No, I wanted me to go down there. But this serious issue with lamb, and uh, she never manages to cook it. So this time, I said, look, I'll tell you what, because she got three days off on the trot and it gives us some time to think about it, I'm gonna get some lamb again. She likes lamb, and I know I don't mind lamb, but I know she likes it. I said, so just make sure it's cooked. All you got to do, when you think it's cooked, you get a long meat fork, you stick it in, you squeeze it down. If the juice is run clear, it's cooked. I mean, how hard is it? Can I stick a fork in you and see if you're cooked? <sighs> well, if you carry on like this, madam. Anyway, so I get in on the phone on the way home. Is it going to be cooked? Yes. Are you sure it's going to be cooked? Yes. Are you sure it's going to be cooked? Yes. Okay. Is the bin going to be eating it tonight? She said, no, it's going to be cooked. Okay. So I walk in, right? And as usual, I needed a five minute power nap because that's what I do sometimes. And uh, I had a quick snooze. She calls me and says, food's ready. So I'll go in. She's taking the meat out of the oven and all the various things that go with it. And I usually cut it. And I looked and I went, the lamb's not cooked. 
sanctuary. It is, it is. Like, no, the lamb's not cooked. And she's going, it is, Mel. Look, I've stuck this fork in, I've squeezed it, the juices are clear, it's cooked. It's been in an hour and a half, it says it only needs an hour and 15 minutes. I've cooked it longer, blah, blah, blah. I said, no, it's not cooked. And she says, it is, and I walk over and I look at it, I says, the lamb's not cooked. And she's looking at me, you can see the frustration in her face, which is quite amusing. And I lean out and I have a little sniff. I go like that. And I'm like, the lamb's not cooked. And she says, yes it is. And she walks over, looks at it, she sniffs it herself. I don't know why she sniffs it, right? And then she stood there. She's looking at me, and she's looking at the lamb. And she's looking at me, and she went, that's pork, isn't it? <laughs> She'd cooked the pork, thinking it would... And now this is what I have to put up with. Anyway, I'm glad that I've got that one in before the end, so... Before you... God, you're getting all dressed already. Yeah, well, I've got bus to catch. Yeah, what time's your bus? Uh, no, what time's your bus? 7.54. Right, what time is it now? It's 8.45. Oh, 28, 7.28. Right, and your buzz is at what time? Oh, well, come on. 7.45? Yes, come on. And where's the bus station? Over there. And how far away is that? <laughs> Two minutes. Right, anyway, say goodbye. Bye then. Say thank on. you for coming. No, anyway, so that was our first little video. Um, welcome back to us. Because <laughs> she's got a job, all right? Yeah. Okay, that's well put it. Thank you, uh, tea lady. What time you finish? Five, sir. Oh, early today. Oh, I told you this yesterday. I told you I did. I did. I told you. And what time are you going to be home? I've got half six. Half six. Or, oh, yeah. do you want fish pie? Yeah. Please. All right, darling. I'll see you. Turn it off. Yeah. Just press the top one once. Uh, on top one. And then you take the camera and give it to me if you want.